Hey friends, happy Thursday. It's been a while since I've done a video, and again, like I told you, they are done in my car. I wanted to talk a little bit today about breastfeeding and Metafast. If anybody has ever watched my personal channel, which is I Love My Boy 0321 or Naptime Blitz, um, you'll know that I have an eight month old baby who I am exclusively nursing. He actually nurses more than he eats and I have been able to do this while I'm at a fast. Somebody I know pulled up next to me, so I had to cut the cord on the court recording. Anyways, <clears throat> you know that I am nursing my eight month old. He is almost exclusively breastfed. He does eat food like once a day, <clears throat> maybe twice depending on his mood. And I have been able to maintain my supply up until today, actually, um, while on Metafast. I do the program a little bit differently. There is a nursing mother's program. However, I choose in personal life to not eat grains and limited amounts of dairy. So I don't follow the nursing mom's program that Metafast has to offer. But this is what I am doing and it's something that you can try. I stopped taking my supplements called Goat's Rue. Um... There's one by Mother's Milk and there's one by another brand in a yellow bottle. I get them both on Amazon and I take four tablets a day, twice in the morning, twice at night. And up until like three days ago, four days ago, I was taking it. I stopped taking it because I'm like, well, obviously I've had no issue with my, I can pump fine. My baby's like output's been fine. He's been satisfied, blah, blah, blah. Well, then he's been really fussy the last couple days. And, to, and this morning I, he woke up and his little diaper was barely, barely wet. So... It is time to go back on the supplement, so I reordered some and I will be setting that up again. But I have found that if I eat between 12 and 1500 calories a day, which means I'm not upping my carbs, I am upping my protein. So I might eat a Metafast bar and a couple slices of chicken. I might eat a soup and dice up, um, Another person that knows me. This is a bad place. I sh I'm doing this at outside of a work meeting, but I'm like really early for. Um, I might dice up some of that chicken and put it in my tomato soup, stuff like that. So I don't want to add any carbs to my diet because I still like to try to stay around 85 to 90, no more than 90 grams of carbs a day. So I choose very lean meats and I choose um, low carb fat options and low car lower carb veggies. But I do add in a little bit of extra protein. That is because nursing does burn quite a bit of calories. They say around four to 500 calories depending on the baby. And so if you're burning 400 calories and you're only consuming 800 calories, you're gonna put your body into starvation mode. And that's the last thing you want. You want your body to be um, full of nutrients and fully functioning and not in starvation mode. So if you are nursing, make sure that you are um, not eating the typical five in one plan. You could do a four and two. Um, the only thing with four and two is the carbs get off a little bit. Um, or you can add just a little bit of protein. It's worked for me. And I do strongly suggest that you take supplements um, for milk production um, as you navigate this because changes in diet very much change your milk supply. And you don't want to have to give that up if you don't want to. So I'm not ready to give it up. So I do take goat's roux. I've tried fenugreek. I've tried blessed thistle. Um, that worked for my other two. But this one, it really upsets his stomach and mine as well. So I take this goat's roux, like I said, twice a day. And eat a little bit more protein throughout the day. And I've been able to lose. Um, today I'm in the middle of week five. Well, week five started on Monday and it's Thursday. So I'm in the middle of week five. And I am down 17 pounds. So... I mean, that's super great for me. I can't wait to see what it is once I drop nursing and drop down to the, um, you know, 800 and some calories that you have on a typical Metafast plan, <clears throat> as well as my hormones starting to regulate and causing more weight to drop once I'm done nursing. So it is doable and it is very much navigatable and it is very much trial and error. So if you are wanting to join Metafast and you are nursing, hit me up. I will walk you through the steps for free of MetaFast so that you can start feeling um, hot about your body too. So I hope you guys are all doing super, super great and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye guys.